Hey everyone, here's a Tight Lines throwback that aired on Fox 29 News back in 1996. It's a tarpon fishing episode we filmed with Captain Greg Bogdan outside Palm Beach Inlet. Nothing gets the adrenaline going more than chasing big tarpon down the beach, especially when you can see them. Now, you gotta check out Greg's hairdo in this one. Plus, the commentary from the news desk is pretty funny too. Watch. Sometimes the biggest fish swim in the shallowest water. Tom Twyford proves it by hooking a spectacular game fish. Here's our demon of the depths, our swami of shallows, Tarpon Tom, with tonight's edition of Tight Lines. You don't need sophisticated fish finding equipment to locate tarpon. A unique swim bladder allows these silver kings of the shallows to gulp air on the surface. Rolling fish will reveal the hot spot. Light tackle specialist Captain Greg Bogdan targets them. Here's how he does it. Live bait like sardines and menhaden are best. Despite what many think, though, you can catch tarpon on dead bait. In fact, chunking with pieces of bait fish is a well-established tarpon technique in places like Key West Harbor. And it works in our own backyard just as well. Nice fish. If tarpon tried out for the Olympics, there's no doubt you'd see him on the gymnastic team. <laughs> this fish is among the best when it comes to acrobatics. That is a nice fish. A lot of people don't realize that there are good quantities of tarpon here off the Palm Beaches, especially this time of year. The key to catching them is to intercept them along their migratory routes just off the beach. The productive zone for sighting them is anywhere from the beach on out to about 25 feet of water. Another key is to look for clean water. And the hot spots right now? Up and down the whole beach from Hope Sound all the way to uh, Boynton Inlet. It's excellent fishing. 20 pound class tackle is ideally suited for these great game fish. If you hook up with one approaching triple digits though, you can expect to sweat. It's a good kind of sweat though. <laughs> As so often happens with tarpon, the end of the battle was somewhat anticlimactic. While trying to bring the fish boat side, we popped the leader, but still a tremendous thrill. To get your thrills, just cross a cruising tarpon's path. For Fox 29 and the West Palm Beach Fishing Club, I'm Tom Twyford. Tight lines. Exciting fishing action. Ah, uh, my mouth is watering just thinking of a big, uh, big uh, tarpon, tarpon there on the and plate. Those you know, seas catch were flat. They were flat. Yeah, that's right. Well, that's what we were observing. By the way, you don't eat tarpon. <laughs> so no, we no. From that. But what fish. you could see.